good afternoon it's friday and um monday is the next announcement this is going to start to change things and it's all for the better so my first thing that i wanted to say and i've been chatting to lots of people you know it is convenient the online it will remain in some capacity we're doing this bit by bit, month by month, as things start to change. And yes, the, you will always have the access to the online. Even when we can take everything back face to face, the online is going to be there as an option for those who want it. But just let me say that, and this being Mental Health Awareness Week, it really is so important to take time for you. And we're all so time poor. We don't diary that time in for ourselves. And it's been fantastic to be able to do the classes from home. And for some people, that does really work. But don't forget, human interaction, you cannot beat. And we need to get our community back together face to face. And I just think that's so, so important moving forward. So just bear that in mind when you're thinking, oh, I can't, I can't get to that class. You know, make the effort, diary the time. The classes are only 45 minutes. So there you've already shaved off some time. We've done it before. We can do it again. So there's where we are with it. So end of May or the Friday, the 21st of May, I'm going to start drip feeding some classes back face to face. LBT and fitness Pilates, basically just those four classes that take you up to the end of May. And I've put everything in this week's email. Um, they will also, those four classes, be live streamed online so don't worry about that and then we hit june and there's a new timetable a few tweaks here and there i've tried to make the evening classes really kind of varied in timing so that everybody gets you know you know i know people are working later or people like the early classes i've tried to kind of even that out as such i've also put on a new class on tuesday evening with danielle i know there was so much great feedback so i thought i'm going to give her an evening slot it's a later time of eight o'clock on tuesday at the Stafford school um, and there are i know lots of people that are concerned that they won't make the earlier classes so that's going to be fantastic for you guys um and the hall at Distaffa takes 26 people so we're great with that for the halls like the methodist church that we're only able to take 15 just until up till july so for all through june i will still live stream those class smaller classes where we can't perhaps get everybody in um and then end of june there'll be another change and hopefully I'll be able to then bring you bring you some more news as to where we go moving forward. But let's just take this bit by bit because things, as you can see by the by the news, things are changing all the time. A bit iffy on this new variant, but um, fingers crossed we'll all be good to go. So have a read of the email, please. Any questions, fire them across. All of these classes that I'm drip feeding in face to face the end of May. There's no specific place on the website. Just go to where the outdoor classes are and I've kind of incorporated it there. I hope that makes sense. So listen, everyone, I'm so looking forward to seeing you back face to face. Um, obviously, there will still be people doing the online. Great too. Um, just be aware that where I'm live streaming, it's really hard to engage with two groups. So, And because I'm sort of moving laterally across the hall, what I'm going to do is position the camera kind of to the side at an angle so it's out of the way of everybody yet you can still sort of see me and what's going on so it's all trial and error let's get you back to classes this is me staying in the halls face to face with you guys is going to be dependent on the uptake so i need you to come back and support it all right so excited have a wonderful weekend lots of love and spread the news bye